All right, welcome back to Old Man Tech. Uh, got a few comments on some past videos uh, on uh, people having problems with Exodus and uh, some of the other uh, add-ons that were installed by the TV add-ons repository. Now, I've also experienced some of the issues too, so I searched around, found a, a different source, and I found another uh, another repository that seems to be really good. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and install it. Now, I am installing this on the latest version of Kodi, 17.1 Krypton, latest version. Um, if you have 16.1 or 6.2, what is it? 16, whatever. Um, it's very similar. Of course, you're going to have to find out where the favorites is and all that, but the, you can see that on a past video. However, here we go. Really, really simple to do. Now, first, before installing it, there are a couple settings I, I like to change, um, and let's do that really quick. We're going to go to the settings, little uh, gear-looking thing right there. I'm going to go to system settings and down here first of all I like to change this from standard to click it again expert just to um, so all the options are available to me uh, under standard not all the options are there so uh, anyway so we want to go to uh, where are we at add-ons and this one right here says unknown sources we want to ch uh, we want to enable that because uh, as it is by default Cody sets it where you cannot install add-ons from an, a source other than what Cody allows. So we want to change that so we can uh, use, you know, use a bunch of different uh, repositories. So we did that. Let's go ahead and back one, back up one level. We're going to go to uh, interface. Now this is something I like to do. Screen saver, I like to change that to none. All right. And that should be enough for right now. Of course, there's a lot of other settings you can change if you'd like, but all right, so let's uh, go now. We're going to install. Now, in the past, I used TV add-ons uh, repository to install uh, Exodus and Phoenix, some other things. I am now using Noobs and Nerds, and I'll show you how to get there. What we want to do is go to, uh, let's go to Settings again. Go to File Manager. Let's provide the uh, the URL so, uh, so we can install it. URL is http colon four slash four slash noobs n o o b s and nerds dot com forward slash portal. Here we go noobs and nerds dot com forward slash portal. Make sure you put the s after noobs and at the end, or else it won't work. All right, click that and say I'm going to enter that. Oop, what did I do? Did I do? Oh, my bad. It's already there. Um, Oh, you know what? I actually put that in the wrong spot. Sorry about that. What we want to do is uh, click this up here so we can put the path in there. My bad. All right. So in the path, you can put HTTP colon four slash four slash noobs and nerds dot com four slash portal. Noobs. Like I said, make sure you put the S's in there. I forgot them earlier and it didn't work. So there you go. And down here we're going to call it something. Yeah, I put all that in there. I meant to uh, put it in the other section. Hopefully it doesn't confuse it too much. I'm just going to call it Noobs. Uh, just to make it uh, easy. So I have to type so much. So there you go. So that's the URL. That's the source, right? And here's the name of it. So, and the no, name, of course, you can change to whatever you like. All right, so there it is, noobs, right there. So now let's back up another level. And in this same section, let's go to, oh, no, nope, no, nope, we're going to back up another level all the way back to the home screen. There we go. And over here on the left-hand side where it says add-ons, let's click that so we can add an add-on. Up here in a little package, little symbol, let's click that. And here we go. We're going to install from a zip file. That zip file is located in the URL or at the URL that we just provided. So click that. And there's noobs that we just provided. And you see down here in the bottom, it's going to be down here, but when I highlight it, noobsandnerds.com forward slash portal. That's, you know, that's the location of this. So let's click that. All right. We're now in that zip file. Or, well, we're selecting that zip file, the noobs and nerds underscore repos. It's going to install the, re, uh, the repository for noobs and nerds. Click that. And let's give it a little bit. Let it do its thing. Noobs and nerds repo repository add on updated. It may say updated, it may say uh, enabled, but uh, yeah, it's good to go. There we go. It did its thing. Now we're going to install it from the repository that we just installed, right? Click from repository. And there you go. Of course, that's what 
Cody themselves provide, but here's what we just installed. So let's click that. Now, now we're inside the repository. We're inside Noobs and Nerds repository. In there, they have a bunch of different options. You got different video add-ons. You got different music add-ons, program add-ons. We're going to add um, now just from just for Cody. I mean, I'm sorry, Cody. Just for Exodus, we're going to go into the program add-ons because normally you would go to video add-ons and find you know different add-ons, Zen, Phoenix, what what have you. Um, but Exodus is located somewhere else. So let's go ahead and install or go into the program add-ons. In there we want to install the community portal. This is going to have um, basically all the add-ons available in here. So let's click that. We're going to go down here and say install. And this does take a little bit. You can see it's downloading. Alright, it's already installed. So now the add-on is installed on our computer. Now let's do this. Just while we're here, let's go back one and go to video add-ons. They have a couple different ones here. Like I said, they got Zen, this one, and Bob, Sports Devil. Those all seem to be pretty good. You can always install those if you want to also. But uh, the Exodus, I'm sorry, the Community Portal has been installed in the Programs add-on section. So let's go ahead and go there. Let's go ahead and back up all the way back to the main menu. And there you go. You see add-ons under the Program add-on section is Community Portal. This is the noobsandnerds.com community portal. So let's go ahead and click that. Did I click it? Well, let's hit enter. There we go. Give it just a second. Now, just a little disclaimer here. I am also downloading a, a game onto my Xbox One, so it's really eating up some bandwidth. So it's going to be a little slow and I have to download things, but uh, just be just be patient. It'll get there. So anyway, so from inside the community portal, we're going to click on Add-on Portal. And there you go. The, this is where you're going to find all your different add-ons. Now, I like to go to popular because it shows the 10 most downloaded add-ons. Of course, you've got different ways to search for certain add-ons. If you've heard of one, you can actually uh, you know, do a manual search or what have you. But uh, yeah, let's go to popular. And sure enough, in here, whoop, it's, it's so weird. When it scrolls, it scrolls fast. So you got to be careful. Yep, see? So let's just do it by, uh, by the keyboard. There we go. So Exodus. There's Exodus right there. We're going to click Exodus. And like I said, be patient with me. It's going to be a little slow because of uh, I'm downloading stuff. But yeah, we're going to go right there, install Exodus. And we're going to select that. All right, I'd like to give it a, a few more seconds after. Yeah, see, that's why. Uh, most common cause, uh, unable to install. Blah, 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 blah. I've had this a couple times. You just do it again, and it should work. Let's go one more time, just to make sure. Again, it may be because I'm downloading a bunch of stuff, and I'm hogging up all the bandwidth. Okay, so it finally installed. Um, like I said, it's it's because I'm downloading a bunch of stuff. But anyway, so now Exodus is installed. Let's go ahead and back out. Hit Escape or just the back button on your uh, Fire Stick. And there you go. You can see under the Add-on section. Whoop, Add-on section. There you go. Right there is uh, is Exodus. Go ahead and click that. There's all your different options there. Movies, TV shows, so forth. Let's go to TV shows just for the heck of it. Uh, people watching. Let's go to there so we know... Um, so we can see what other people are watching here. All right, let's uh, let's grab Walking Dead. Hopefully you've seen it. We'll go to the last episode, which was the last episode of the season, by the way. Um, yep, there it is right there. But let's go ahead and we're going to do this. We're going to see the very... Was this the one with uh, Negan in it? 
crushing dude's head? Yep, sure is. Let's watch that. <laughs> Just make sure it works. That was a great scene, by the way. Poor Glenn. So let's go ahead and just pick the top one. AMC's The All New Episodes premiere Sunday nights at 9 and check Just do a quick little fast forwarding so we can get close to the action Whoop. Again a little jumping only because I'm downloading stuff I should have waited to do this video but uh, but anyway you see that it does work um, yeah Exodus it's great. I mean, uh, I'm sorry, noobs and nerds. Great, uh, a great repo. Um, I'm going to be using that from now on. Like I said, I used to always use TV add-ons, but now I use this. Now, now, just recap because, um, you know, just to make sure I didn't confuse anybody. It's it's just really quick. Show how to do it. Okay, really s simple. If you've already, if you got it, fine. If you're new to this and you want some more instruction, let's try it one more time. You ready? Really simple to install. From the main menu, you have to go to the settings. Go to File Manager. That's where you go and, and add a source. Right here, you would put http colon forward slash forward slash noobsandnerds.com forward slash portal. That'll be written down in the comments so you can make sure. You would then, I'm, I'm going to cancel here, of course. Uh, you Then down here, you would name it something, whatever you want to name it. I named mine dot noobs, but you can name it whatever you want. I'm canceling again, of course. Canceling again, okay, so it creates this. All right, go back one level. I'm sorry, two levels. Now in the add on section, you would click add ons up here in the little package, little symbol. You would click that. You would say install from zip file. From there, you would then select the URL that we created, noobs. We would click that. Go down here to noobs and nerds repo.zip. I'm not going to do it because it's already installed, but you would click that. And there we go. And then once that's installed, says it's good to go, then you would go to install from repository. No, I'm sorry, you don't have to do a repository. That's right. In th this one, we would go because, uh, oh, I'm sorry, yeah. You would go to install from repository. Sorry, I even got crazy there. Anyway, we'd go in the noobs and nerds repository. We would then go in the program add ons. You would enable, you would select this and install the community portal. Okay, that installs the community portal in the program sections of add ons. So if you go all the way back out, go to your add ons section under programs, there's community portal. You click community portal. You then would go to the add on portal and go to popular, or you can manually search for Exodus, but I just go to popular. Go down to now. I use my uh, use this, of course, to go. Now it says it installed, obviously, because I've already installed it. But you would select Exodus and hit Enter and install it. Once you install it, you can back out of this completely. Go back to your add-ons and under the video add-on section, sure enough, there's Exodus. So it's really, really easy to install. Um, yeah, go ahead and try that. Noobs and nerds, noobsandnerds.com. Great little uh, repository. All right, thanks for guys. Thanks guys for watching. And, uh, yeah, check back for more videos. Um, yeah, peace.